हेलो एवरी वन असलम वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक दैर इज द ओरल कैंसर वार्निंग साइंस एंड प्रिवेंशन नाउ इंडिया हैज़ वन ऑफ द मोस्ट नंबर ऑफ केसेज फॉर ओरल कैंसर मोस्टली बिकॉज अ लॉर ऑफ पीपल आर हैविंग टोबैको सिगरेट्स एंड ऑल दीज थिंग्स वी ऑल नो दे आर नॉट गुड फॉर आर हेल्थ एंड मोस्ट ऑफ द पेशेंट्स बाई द टाइम दे सीक अ ट्रीटमेंट इट्स टू लेट so in this video i will be discussing how you can check for the symptoms of oral cancer on your own and if you suspect something you know that it's the right time to visit a doctor so let's begin now do you know where can oral cancer appear mouth cancer also known as oral cancer is where a tumor develops on the surface of tongue mouth lips or gums now it can be white patches red patches or it can be like ulcer which is not healing it can also occur in the salivary glands tonsils and the pharynx what is a pharynx the part of throat from your mouth to your windpipe but these are less common okay so how often does oral cancer spread to other part of the body now these oral cancers they spread to other parts of the body so can it go anywhere unfortunately any cancer has the potential to spread in any other human system that's why cancer is such a frightening disease and apart from spreading oral cancer also causes chronic pain loss of function facial and oral disfigurement and even death if it is not diagnosed and treated in its early stages so it's smart to know the warning signs and learn how to prevent them so let us see what are the common symptoms to watch for let's discuss them in detail one by one a white or red patch in your mouth or an ulcer which is not healing even after 2 3 weeks a sore throat or a feeling that something is caught in your throat difficulty in chewing swallowing speaking a growth or lump inside your mouth numbness in your tongue or other areas of your mouth or ear pain so you have to make an appointment with the doctor or dentist if you have any persistent signs and symptoms that bother you for more than 2 weeks Now let me ask you a question have you ever wondered what puts you at risk for oral cancer there are several factors that increase the risk for example tobacco use smoking cigarettes cigars pipes or using smokeless or chewing tobacco is one of the most well known risk of oral cancer 90% of the patient who have oral cancer they take all these things consuming large amount of alcohol Heavy drinkers are more likely to be diagnosed with oral cancers. For people who use tobacco along with alcohol, the danger is much higher. Human papilloma virus. Cancers that are linked to HPV are generally found at the back of your throat, base of the tongue and in the tonsils. Sun exposure. An excess of sun exposure on the lips increases the risk. Yes, you heard me right. You may be surprised to know that many cases are preventable and with recent advancements in technology the tumor can be easily removed without any complications. So the earlier the treatment starts the better is the result. Now let's talk about preventive and the treatment options. To greatly reduce the chances of developing cancer you should consider preventing high risk behaviors such as smoking and tobacco use also avoid excessive alcohol intake. get regular dental checkups only dentists can spot the early signs of mouth cancer so when you're going for your regular checkup you are also giving a chance to your dentist to check any signs of oral cancers now let's take a look at the treatment part there are three main options available surgery where the cancerous cells are surgically removed chemotherapy where powerful medications are used to kill the cancerous cells radiotherapy where high energy x-rays are used to kill the cancerous cell so you must understand this oral cancer can strike at any age whether you use tobacco or not though the risk with tobacco is much higher even if a person is not taking tobacco or alcohol doesn't mean that he can be cancer free 100% there can be some chances most of the time the early signs of oral cancer can be difficult to spot and therefore sometimes easily overlooked that you have to keep in mind so get regular dental checkups for cleaning and see your dentist right away if you have any symptoms that worry you that's all for today i hope you like today's video if you have any questions and happy to answer them so you can comment below thanks for watching allah hafiz